I'd like to uh, introduce Moons again, as he is our CTO, and he likes to explain a bit more about our cloud API platform. Hello, Martin, and he hello, everybody, and thank you for joining. I'll go through some of the elements that our solution is based on a, a number of services and APIs. The major ones are Cloud Core, which is what we use for placing orders, doing quotes. And it's cloud processing, which is a background service that is taking care of the orders once they're in the cloud printer system and makes sure to communicate with the productions. Then we have a cloud admin, which is where everything is administrated. This is where you go in, you set up your products, you set up your uh, how you want to deliver products to us, and how you want signals back, etc. Every configuration that we can do uh, is made from cloud admin. Then we have cloud quote. It's a quite big area, but it's it's basically asking us for a quote uh, on a simple data structure for an order getting a quote back with the price on the product and the, a number of shipping options. This is giving you, a, in a very, very short time, a good indication of what uh, we can do with this, what uh, price, le uh, price level it is, and which shipping options you can get uh, for this specific product. Then we have client, Cloud Insights. This is where we collect data about performance for productions, um, which products are ordered, uh, how long time they have been in production, how far they are, et cetera, et cetera. And we use that for doing a lot of calculations. Some of it is for SLA uh, limitations, and some of it is to figure out if a production is performing well, or if we should start switching order to a new production, et cetera. Last one we have on the chart here today is Cloud Signal. This is the service that is making sure that signals from the production are received correctly in cloud printer processed and if you are requesting signals on status and orders etc we send or it sends uh, the signals to you in the format again that you have configured and to the input that you have configured okay so moans just if if you allow me to ask so basically i integrate cloud core into my ordering system into my corporate application or whatever to push orders to cloud printer. Then with cloud process, you process them in terms of validation and normalization. With the cloud admin, I can set up order routing uh, rules to for specific markets or for specific printers. And with cloud quote, I can basically show all the shipping prices available for that destination address in my shopping cart. Is that correct? That is correct. Okay, and then cloud signal that are basically the webhooks that can trigger, let's say, an email to my customer that uh, the order is being received or is being printed or is now currently in the finishing department or is being shipped, that can trigger events on the site of a customer, right? That is correct. And it also includes the tracking number once, once the order is shipped. Okay. We write there that we are connected with 160 carriers. That means that we provide multiple service level in each country in the world. 